Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development. And so, guys, in this video, I will show you how to check if the uh, Wi-Fi is enabled or disabled using broadcast receivers. All right, guys. So let me show you the app which we I am going to teach you. So let's open the app. Okay, so here Wi-Fi is on. All right. So if I disable the Wi-Fi here you can see Wi-Fi is off all right and if I again enable the Wi-Fi okay so here you can see Wi-Fi is on all right so let's get started so guys first of all what we need to do is we need to uh, use a switch okay so ha here we have we will have a switch and after that we need to initialize the switch Powered x2 equals to switch find view by id dot switch 2 okay just ignore that okay it's not of our use or all right so after that what we are what we need to do here is we need to use uh, okay so we need to create a class broadcast receiver equals to new broadcast receiver okay and here what we need to do is now we need to uh, get the wi-fi state so we say int wi-fi state extra equals to intent dot get int extra and now we need to use the wi-fi manager dot extra wi-fi state all right and the default value if the state is not i mean uh, we uh, the wi-fi manager could not get the uh, state then the default state will be wi-fi manager dot wi-fi state unknown all right it will be the default state after that what we can do now we can check if wi-fi state extra equals to wi-fi manager dot wi-fi state enabled if it is enabled what we need to do is we need to check s2 dot set check to true and also we need to set text Wi-Fi is on all right else if Wi-Fi state extra equals to Wi-Fi manager dot Wi-Fi state disabled and we need to set checked false and also that the text to Wi-Fi is off. All right, and now we need to uh, register this receiver. So we need to override the method on start. All right, and also we need the method on stop. So in our on start method, we need to initialize the intent filter. New and filter and in here we need to use wi-fi manager dot wi-fi state change action all right and then we can say register receiver so first of all we will have broadcast receiver and intent filter all right that's it and in our own stop we need to unregister that so we can say and register broadcast receiver all right and the last thing you need is go to your android manifest file and here need a permission access wi-fi state all right so now when you run the application all right so now you will have this kind of application so when you uh, i mean let's run it again okay so when we switch off the Wi-Fi, so here you can see Wi-Fi is off. And if I click on switch on the Wi-Fi, so the Wi-Fi is on. All right, guys. So if you like the video, please like it and subscribe. Goodbye.